Welcome to MathsMaster.org. Let's learn the names of 2D shapes. So what do I mean by 2D shapes? Well, 2D just means two dimensions. And what that means is that the shapes are flat. They just have a width and a height, but they don't have any depth to them, like, for example, a cube would have. So you can draw these shapes completely flat, and that's what a 2D shape is. Then we split up uh, the 2D shapes into two separate groups. And we base this on whether all the sides are straight or not. So if you look at the shape, and all of the sides are straight, straight lines, then you call that shape a polygon. So if all the sides are straight, then that shape is a polygon. If all the sides are not straight, so for example you have some at least well, at least one curved side on the shape, we call that a non-polygon. So let's have a look at polygons now, and they are 2D shapes uh, with straight sides. So a many-sided 2D shape with straight sides is called a polygon. Now we group polygons into families, if you like, that are based on how many sides they have. So a three-sided polygon is called a triangle. A four-sided polygon is called a quadrilateral. A five-sided polygon is a pentagon. A hexagon is a six-sided polygon. A heptagon is a seven-sided polygon. The family of eight-sided polygons are called octagons. And nonagons are nine sided polygons, <clears throat> and decagons are ten sided polygons. Now, we can split each family down into two groups. We can either split uh, polygons into regular polygons, and that means that all the sides on the shape are the same length, and all the angles in the shape are the same size. If polygons aren't regular, they'll be irregular. And that means that all the sides are not the same length, and all the angles are not the same. So let's have a look at the family of polygons that we call triangles. That's polygons with three straight sides. A regular triangle isn't actually called a regular triangle. It's called an equilateral triangle. So a triangle where all three sides are the same length and all three angles are the same are called equilateral triangles. Now we'll look at the irregular triangles. We have an isosceles triangle, a scalene triangle, and a right-angled triangle. Notice the little square in one corner here, that shows that it's a right angle. Okay, the four-sided uh, polygon family is called quadrilaterals, and the regular quadrilateral, again, isn't called a regular quadrilateral, it's actually called a square. And then if we look at the irregular quadrilaterals, we have a rectangle, a parallelogram, a trapezium, a rhombus, a kite, a delta, and an irregular quadrilateral. Now, from the pentagons up to the decagons, they all work pretty much the same way. The regular version of that shape is called a regular pentagon, for example, or a regular hexagon, regular heptagon, and so on. The irregular versions of those shapes are called irregular pentagon, irregular hexagon, irregular heptagon, and so on. So they all work the same way, as you can see here. So if we get an overview of our family of polygons, or our families of polygons, you can see in this diagram here that we group them according to how many sides uh, the shapes have. So you can see that the families of triangles and quadrilaterals have, have more shapes, if you like, more shape names than, than the pentagons to the decagons.
And so we base uh, the names of shapes, uh, we put them into families based on how many sides they've got. Uh, then we split them into either being regular shapes or irregular. So a regular polygon is a polygon which has all the sides the same length and all the angles are the same. On the irregular polygons, not all sides are the same length and not all angles are the same. And you can see here that the triangles and quadrilaterals have a slightly larger family of irregular polygons than all the others. So let's have a look now at the most common non-polygons. So here's the most common non-polygon. It's a circle. It has just one curved side. Half of a circle is called a semicircle. So this shape here is called a semicircle. This is an oval. Looks quite like an egg really, doesn't it? And this shape is an ellipse. Ellipse. That was the names of 2D shapes. If you'd like to see some more fantastic maths videos, please visit mathsmaster.org.